Hey guys, this is uh, Mr. McBride. Um, I try to do these videos every week, uh, once a week, um, just to kind of intro the learning um, for you guys. Uh, excuse my hair, you know, there's no barbers open. You know, Mr. McBride stay with the fresh shape up, line up, edge up, whatever you call it. But I'm trying to do these videos every week uh, so you can see my face. I know you all miss my face. You, I know you all miss my voice. Um, <clears throat> Okay, so this week, um, sixth grade, uh, we are continuing our study on Australia. Um, last week, we looked at the geography, um, where is it located, things of that nature. This week, we're going to delve a little bit deeper into how Australia was colonized, um, how was it made a sustainable country that we all know today. Um, so we're going to talk about how it was colonized, okay? Um, the, the kind of broad theme for um, this lesson is to look at the ESPN um, concept and theme that we have looked at in, in class, all right? So E, remember, is, is uh, economic, excuse me, economic, which is money, trade, resources, um, anything dealing with currency or exchanging of goods, okay? Trade resources, okay? The S is social, okay? Remember, that's really broad. Social is how you interact with other uh, people, interact with other people. Um, religion, people's religion, food, people's culture, uh, people's music, right? Holidays, clothing, all right, what you wear, okay, um, your language, all right, that's all goes into social, okay, political is the P, all right, power, uh, labor unions, um, they'll talk about unions in this, that's, that's political, um, government, all right, uh, people having power over somebody else, that's all political, politics, okay, and um, and is environment, okay? Environment has to deal with land, has to deal with farming, um, has to deal with, um, you know, any type of crops, okay? So th those ESPN four concepts are very important for you to understand and for you to activate that prior knowledge that we learned in class um, prior, okay? Um, uh, some big takeaways from this um lesson uh, is going to be colonization, um, the Europeans coming to Australia and kind of taking over their, the Australians' um, native culture. Uh, they're going to, you know, fight with them. Um, and anytime Europeans usually um, colonize or take something else over, the the individuals, the people, um, the natives of that country that they took over are going to lose and suffer the consequences. But also the Europeans are going to always think in history that they're better than um, the individuals or or um, land that they take over. OK, so you saw that when um, the Europeans came over to the United States and we looked at that, how um, the Native Americans were seen as dumb. They were not seen as intelligent. So the Europeans kind of took advantage of that, used their guns against their spears and took their whole culture and wiped them out. All right. So some major themes, um, Aborigines, you're going to hear that a lot, that those are kind of the natives to Australia. Okay, those they were there before the Europeans came over and messed everything up and colonized them. Okay, uh, assimilation, right? If I assimilate, okay, um, that means that wherever um, wherever I'm at, I am adopting their culture. I don't have my culture at all. Okay, or somebody is colonizing where I am at. Okay, and making me fo and, and and forcing me to assimilate to their culture. OK, so, for example, the Aborigines uh, may have um, celebrated a holiday like um, Easter, but then the European um, colonists came over and said, "Nah, we're not doing that anymore. You have to 
celebrate this holiday or you have to go to school um, and do and learn this instead of what they were learning before. Or a big thing is religion. A lot of Europeans um, use religion to oppress uh, the natives in any country. They did the Native Americans. They did this to the Aborigines that you'll learn to, today. Okay, so I want you to keep those things in mind. All right, um, so uh, when you go throughout um, these lessons, guys, I'm going to try to keep the lessons very formulaic, right? So they're going to they're going to look the same, and you're going to need to produce kind of um, the same type of uh, format, right? And my thought process on that is to keep it um, kind of uh, the same structure. Right. Um, because this is all new to everybody. And I just kind of want to make sure that you're getting the content, but also you're not um, struggling with, OK, now we got to do this. Now I got to do that. No, we're going to we're going to stick to a formula. OK, we're going to get the content. All right. And we're going to learn every week. OK, some reminders, vocab slide at the end, please. Picks on every slide, um, except for the vocab slide, a subject line. Um, the subject line in the email when you send me the subject line it has to say the last name okay in week four all right complete sentences all right and then please check my Twitter for updates daily uh, you don't need to have a Twitter um, and I'm going to upload uh, new content every Tuesday okay all right have a good one